The first weekend of the great spring break crackdown in Miami Beach appears to be a success. Restrictions, including the closing of the beach at 6 p.m. and liquor stores at 8 did the trick, along with the heavy police presence. It's almost midnight here on the strip and police enforcement really seems to be working. You can see why. Take a look over here. I count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten police cars with officers all keeping an eye on spring breakers. They're patrolling on bikes and ATVs as well as on foot, all in an effort to avoid scenes like this from last year. Are you saying to spring breakers, stay away? To some extent, yes. Yes, I <laughs> yes. know. <laughs> I'm not going to I'm not going to sugarcoat that. Reaction from spring breakers we encountered was mixed. I just think that there's a balance right between over policing and um, kind of killing the energy because it feels a little bit uh, it feels a little bit quiet here. It feels like people want to move to a different area. Honestly, we had a little bit more fun the past years, but I still, I mean, I, I like having police around me. So where'd everybody go? Well, Fort Lauderdale and South Padre Island, Texas, seem to be up to the same type of shenanigans they've been known for.